family. That's the great thing about it. It's so easy to use. So um, this is my account. Of course, I've lo I'm already logged in. And when you go here to your to the first uh, page, you won't have this because I already created one. You'll you'll have like a, uh, a explainer page. You know, taking you through um, an action, like a for instance. You know, and it'll show you different. Uh, let me show you. Like this here would, wouldn't be this. It would be another um, default that they program in there to show you an example on how to walk you through setting it up, which it's really, really easy. I mean, if you can make a fan book, I mean, a Facebook fan page, then you can definitely do this. So, what the idea is, I've uh, got a default, a dummy. Or another Facebook profile that I've created to land on this is my original Facebook page so Sammy success so say somebody lands on it and they wanted to find out more about something that I'm promoting or whatever and they want to send me a message so they just um, you know come here and oh wait let me remove this because this is when I was testing this initially. So so they would see this. They would come to this and they would see this. Okay, 184 people like this. Get started. So when they click that immediately from this, you know, from that chat field, it automatically displays this right here. You know, online tips and tricks, um, free downloads for these uh, ebooks. So if you want them, I mean, they're already here, but some people, you know, they may not understand. If you click the button, they would might say "Hey" or something, or or "Hi" or whatever you type in there, you know. And then it just enter your email. So, you know, they they enter the email, or if they don't, they just put "Hi." Want to get access to my ebook? And then, you know, if they say yes, which they've already you know it takes them right back to you to these buttons so basically it's just an automated way for for somebody to reply back and get them you know to gather their email information or you can take them through you know whatever process you want whatever kind of like funnel so to speak that you want to take them through you know you can put it in there so I thought that was really cool and I just wanted to share that with you and this is a little bit about the back office here when you're inside of it this you can create different um, default answers so this is the default answer I create so glad that I can help you get things started if you would like to get some very helpful strategies comment yes you know. so no matter what they say you know that's gonna pop up if it works so the bot kind of figures it out as you go but to create a block is very easy. You know, you just come here and you can just add, add text, add whatever, and it, or a card. I'm sorry, you know, and you can put an image, quick, quick reply. That's what this is. That's what I set up. A quick reply, meaning it has the links and whatever. So whatever they, you know, but most people can put a text, you know, an image. Or whatever and uh, one other thing is cool when you get that you go to set up a <clears throat> AI and that's where you kind of create like if someone says this so you can make it more tailored to different keywords you know when somebody says so if someone says some something similar to yes you send them I send them back to that welcome default with the you know the the links in there Okay, if we, if someone says something center, what's up? And then I say well, this, you know, what's up with you? So basically, you can set it up the way that you feel comfortable, you know, with the way that you want to interact with your um, uh, client or whoever that you're trying to talk to. So I hope this was helpful, guys. Have a great rest of the day. Talk to you later.